2016 has been an amazing year for the region. The infrastructure that has come our way has given us the connectivity that we've longed for for generations. The beginning of the construction on the long awaited Toowoomba Bypass is going to make a big change to this community in the future. When we think about exports, the Access China trip in October was an amazing event where we connected with the rest of the world in a hope that we can build business in China. 2016 has seen the completion of the magnificent new Toowoomba Library. What a great resource for this community. Stage one of the Highfield Sports Precinct is now complete and what a magnificent asset it is to the sporting community of this region. The Carnival of Flowers this year was an outstanding success, probably one of the best of all time, growing and attracting more and more people every year. 2017 will see the completion of QIC's amazing development in Toowoomba. It will also see an increase in freight flights out of Brisbane West Wellcamp Airport directly into Asia. In our bid to become a major logistics hub in Australia, we expect to see real clarity around the inland rail in 2017. 2017 will also see more work being done in the enterprise hub. The funding that we've received from the state government will help us build the enabling infrastructure that will provide the jobs of the future. One of the exciting parts about 2017 will see the completion of City Hall upgrade. It will be magnificent, it will add to the ambience of our beautiful Civic Square. As well as that, we've received funding to help us restore the goods shed in the railway yards. That's going to make a profound difference to the CBD area of Toowoomba. I'm excited about 2017 and can I take this opportunity of wishing each and every one of you, the constituents of the Toowoomba region, the very best in 2017. I think there's enormous potential for us to work together to grow this community in a very special way and at the same time preserving that wonderful livability that is so dear to our hearts.